Hey Glam Fam, Linwood here, and today I wanted to deal with you guys on one of my most frequently asked questions, which is about my skincare routine. So as you guys can see here, this is pretty much my skin almost all the time, and I get asked constantly how I keep it clear. Allison gets asked too, but I'm gonna have to let her do her own separate video because she has a different routine as we have different skin types. So my skin type is very oily. I fry chicken with my face. Allison is a bit more combination. So we have different sets of needs for our skin and um, we use different products to kind of cater to those needs. Now we do have a few things that are very much similar, but we are very differing in some ways as well. So uh, I am gonna share my products with you and I have them here off to the side, but I do want to deal with you guys on a couple things because you guys know me. Number one, I'm an educator. Number two, I'm all about holistic health. So I'm about taking care of yourself from the inside out. So that means I'm not just about applying something topically. I'm about what you're eating, how you're eating, uh, what you're doing that could be actually causing the issue so that way you're not fighting it while you cause it. It doesn't make any sense. So just to kind of help you be a little bit less counterproductive, especially if you have oily skin like I do, I hope this video helps you out. The first thing I have to deal with you guys on, especially because I have naturally very oily skin, is that you want to ensure that you are keeping that in mind. So I don't do a lot of high fructose corn syrup or things that have that as an ingredient. Uh, large amounts of sugar like that, especially in high fructose corn syrup, causes my face to break out exceptionally easily. Uh, so usually you can tell if I've been stressed out because I'm a bit of an emotional eater. Um, I'll have a lot of things like chocolate, sweet tea, stuff like that. Having chocolate, especially because it does usually have high fructose corn syrup, tends to break my face out pretty bad. So it's not the chocolate as much as it is the fructose or the sugar content that's there. I also have a little bit of an issue with um, marshmallows, don't ask me why, uh, hot tamales, things like that, like little uh, licorice, stuff like that, uh, that can cause me a lot of issues with my skin just because of the massive amounts of it that I'll eat. So I don't do sodas. Um, I don't do anything that has a lot of high fructose corn syrup in there either. And honestly, I don't do a ton of greasy foods, but that's not just for the sake of my skin. My body just naturally does not process greasy food well. So naturally, I stay a lot slimmer as a result of it because of my different dietary needs for the sake of my health. But it also helps to keep my skin a lot clearer as well. So I'm not as prone to breakouts as I would be if I were eating like the average individual with oily skin. That being said, first starting with nutrition and then going from there. Now, if I notice that I am having a breakout, one of the first things that I'll do is I'll decrease my sugar intake, increase my water intake, and I also increase my fiber intake in terms of fruits, vegetables, uh, psyllium husk, flax seed, um, things like that. So that way, any toxins that are in the body are able to be flushed out. Now, that's my holistic approach. Now, when it comes down to my skincare regimen, I actually use an anti-aging skincare line. As Allison and I have discussed with you guys before, we are in our mid-30s, and um, we've had several people on here that have complimented us on how youthful we look, and I'm gonna go ahead and share with you the line that I use, but just as a disclaimer, I do want you guys to know that I am also a representative of the line, and I'll tell you by the end of the video how I kind of became a part of that and why I became a part of that as well. So the line that I use is called Nerium on my skin. Um, they have a cleanser here, which is golden. I absolutely love it. Um, it's nice, especially like for people with oily skin, things like that, because it's a bit of an oil base, so it helps to get the oil off because it attaches to it. You put it on there dry, and then you go ahead and massage it in. From there, add a bit of water, and it lathers up very lightly. When I rinse it off, it makes my skin feel oil-free without making it feel squeaky clean, and it doesn't dry the skin out at all. Now, the nice thing is like for Allison, because she's a makeup wearer, this actually doubles as a makeup remover, so she's able to remove her makeup and cleanse the skin all at the same time. So that means much less steps. That means you're not having to use makeup wipe, then makeup remover, then cleanser. She can literally just cleanse and get it all off with one foul swoop. So it's amazing for that. Um, the night cream, this stuff here works miracles. And I'll have to show you guys my before and after with this night cream. I use this for 
at first five days and I was impressed with the texture change in my skin there. Even though I don't tend to have a lot of breakouts, the texture tends to be a little bit rough, especially because I don't tend to intake as much water as I should. So um, this here, I mean, when I tell you it made fine lines look less visible. Uh, it, it made it to where I had to stop doing extractions on my blackheads because I wasn't getting blackheads anymore. Uh, it smoothed out any dimples or craters in the skin for me and it just made my skin look a lot more radiant. But the immediate thing that I noticed was the texture of my skin. Uh, upon looking at pictures and things like that, I really noticed the size of my pores diminishing, things like that, with using the night cream. And so basically, like, you would go ahead and cleanse, which you can use your standard cleanser. When I first started using the line, all I was using was the night cream, and the night cream had us so sold that we decided to get a bit further into the company, and now we use a litany of their products for obvious reasons. So the night cream you put on at night, you actually sleep in it. It tightens up like a mask. And then in the morning, you rinse it off and go on about your daily skincare routine. And I mean, you just you notice instant differences with this one here. Um, upon my, what was it, I want to say two weeks after using it, I mean, there's a total difference in my skin. I'll include that photo for you guys uh, on this video as well. Now, um... I am prone to dark circles under the eyes, so they do have an eye serum as well, which I'll be honest with you guys, I use this part-time. It just depends on how sleepy and tired I'm looking that day because it does help out with lightening uh, those areas a, a bit more permanently. Not permanently, but it helps to lighten and, and soften the look of them. Um, and it also helps to like immediately blur the look of that line on there. So I'm going to go ahead... And I'll put some under my right eye for you guys now because I haven't put any on in quite some time. If I can get it to act right, hold on. Um, I used this one, when was it? There we go. You guys can tell I haven't used it in a while. I used this one on my mom for uh, the Dollar Tree makeup challenge to kind of show you guys what it does. I'm just gonna put one pump on there. It's actually more like half a pump. I'm gonna place it up underneath the eye and smooth it on around on it up because I want you guys to see the difference that it does for these eyes. So a lot of people suggest like dabbing it on. I'm just gonna actually take it and rub it right on up until it begins to feel a little bit more dry. So it's feeling a bit more dry. I'm gonna let that sit for a moment. But uh, I use this from time to time and it just depends on how much issue I'm having under the eye. I don't use this one consistently. Now they do have a moisturizer as well, but I will tell you guys, because my skin is so oily, I use this really more as a shaving lotion. So it's nice to me because it helps to diminish any itching and things that I have uh, going on due to shaving. It gives me a nice smooth surface to shave because it, it helps to lubricate the surface a bit. And then after I shave, I use one pump. I'll go ahead and dot here and here and then under here. From there, I'll shave and then afterwards I massage whatever residue is left onto my face. That tends to be enough for me to use because if I'm using it as a recommend on here, it ends up being way too much product for me and it makes my face look even more oily. So I use this very sparingly because my skin skin is very oily. If you have dry skin, this stuff is a lifesaver. So let me go ahead and get a bit closer here. I want you guys to see a difference between this eye and this eye. So of course you guys know there's no camera tricks, anything like that, but I want you guys to be able to see the difference between that and let you guys see why I use this on occasion, especially if it's been a lot of work or like Glamtober. Glamtober I was filming constantly, I was hardly sleeping, so this eye serum did wonders for helping me look a bit more refreshed and awake. Um, they do also have some other stuff for that, especially if you're prone to like bags under the eyes, but thankfully I don't have that issue. Um, but yeah, so those are the products that I use. Now, in terms of how I got involved with them is actually one of my clients. Her name is Erica, Erica Hilliard. Uh, she was a client of mine. I was talking to her and she was telling me about what it was she was doing, how she worked from home. And um, I was just interested and I kept having to pull information out of her in terms of trying to figure out like, what is it that you do? And she finally told me, she was like, I work for a company called Nerium. And I was like, okay, so 
what about them and basically long story short she shares with me what they do and about their skincare line how long she's been using it and started showing me her before and afters and I was like wow that's pretty impressive and so she told me she's like well I could use some more before and afters if you wouldn't mind being a model for me and she's like that way you can try the product see how it works and she went ahead and let me use it for five days myself and she just asked me to take a before picture and an after photo and that way she could have something to kind of show people the improvement uh, now mind you I didn't have extremely problematic skin like I told you guys before I do a lot of stuff with nutrition so I really was kind of like okay we're gonna see what this does at that point I was doing extractions on my blackheads every day and at that point I said you know what I'm, I'm gonna use this I'm gonna put it to the test I'm not doing any extractions I went ahead and used it for the five days and I was really impressed and so I was contacting her and she wasn't able to immediately get the product back from me so she was like we'll see if your wife is interested and I went ahead and gave it to Allison to use and it worked wonders on her also and I'll let her tell her own story with it but um, through her using it and myself using it we were essentially sold and I was like I'm in the beauty industry if I see something that works this well I'm going to go ahead and get behind it. I'm not going to be one to just be trying to be involved with anything and trying to sell anything. I need to see results. And being that I could see it and trust it on my skin, it made it to where when I had my clients coming in and ask me what they could do about their skin conditions, I could give them the nutritional side, but then I can also point them to a line to help them out with some of their issues that they have, especially being that this one is an anti-aging line to help out with removing wrinkles, soft lines, um, or even some harsh lines, things like that. Um, it helps out with breakouts, with acne prone skin for teenagers, with blackheads, with uh, pore, uh, pore refining. They have a line that helps out with firming the skin like for the flags under here or for like that extra little bit here after you've had a baby. Uh, for stretch marks, they've got a ton of different products for people with several different needs. And the things that I love about it is that number one, it's all plant-based product so you don't have to worry about it being full of chemicals and issuing uh, allowing a lot of issues with the skin so it allows me to kind of just ease right on in there with the natural regimen that I already have in terms of the way that I eat and just feeling like I'm taking care of myself from the inside out as well as from the outside in so if you guys have any questions about my skincare routine um, I can film a video showing you guys exactly what I do. I did want to share the products with you guys though just because it takes a lot less for me to film a talking video and kind of fill you guys in on what it is I'm doing and that way you kind of at least know, okay, here's what he does, here's why he does it, here's what he uses. I'll include all the links in the comment box down below. And if you decide to purchase anything, just make sure that you let them know that Glam Fam is your brand partner and that way I can get credit for sending you that way. So um, it'll have on there where it'll ask you all that. If you choose not to do it, totally fine. No pressure one way or the other. But people have been asking me for months and Allison and I started using this, I want to say about five months ago now. And ever since we have, there's been people asking us nonstop about our skin on here. You can go back to some of our older videos and see the difference as well. So of course, as always, let me know what you think in the comment box down below. Until next time, you guys take care. God bless and stay glam. And let me give you a final look at my eyes here. What do you guys think? Treated? Untreated. <laughs> take care, you guys. God bless and stay glam. Bye-bye.